Mario Kart Wii is one of the most popular games of all time, still sitting within the top 20 best-selling games. One of the unique features it has is it supports multiple different types of controllers. It supports four different types. It supports the Wii Remote alone with the Wii Wheel, the Wii Remote with the Nunchuck, the Classic Controller slash Classic Controller Pro, and the GameCube controller. The GameCube controller was able to be used due to the original Wii's backwards compatibility with GameCube games, meaning it had GameCube controller ports built into it. This, however, was lost on later models of the Wii and the Wii U, which did not have these ports. Later on, however, the Wii U did get support for GameCube controllers through Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. Alongside the game, we released a GameCube adapter through USB where you could use your GameCube controllers with the new game. Unfortunately, though, it only works exclusively with this game, and even using it on the Wii Virtual Menu for the Wii U, it doesn't work. For example, I'll load up Mario Kart and show you. So, if I grab one of my GameCube controllers, which is plugged in over here, try and hit the button, nothing happens. If I take my classic controller here, works just fine. This begs the question, are you able to use GameCube controllers on Mario Kart Wii on the Wii U? Well, yes, there are a few ways you can. One way you can do it is to buy an adapter which will emulate the GameCube controller as a classic controller through the Wii Remote. Another method, which is the one I'll show you today, is using uh, a GameCube USB adapter to actually play the, using the GameCube controller. This will be through a mod called CTGP Revolution. CTGP is an incredible and extremely popular Mario Kart Wii mod, which adds 200 plus custom tracks, online support, which is really great, and best of all, GameCube support through the USB adapter. So, if I load up CTGP Revolution right here, if I take my GameCube controller, I can, yeah, I can't actually use it. I'll just do it like this. You can see, I'm actually controlling the menu. My other Wii Remote's still there. I can still control the menu. And here's the thing. So if I click A on launch game, you'll see in the corner there, it says USB GCN on. Okay, I don't need to verify that right now. And you can see, it's a GameCube controller there. You can see by the red B button, and I can go into multiplayer, let's just go into three player. And I can use both these GameCube controllers I have. So I have one there. Let's hit A on the other one. It's the second one. I have classic controller. And there we go. Thank you guys for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, and see you next time. Goodbye!